In case you guys are curious what I'm dealing with here, uh, got a pesky level 9 Kamehameha, but the showcase must go on. Um, We've got our uh, we've got a sketchy boy on the team, Max Power Jackie Tune. He's a Kamehameha, su Kamehameha support type unit. Let's hope he doesn't get us cooked. We're in the uh, Sin Shinron Red Zone event here. Okay, he's not on rotation. Okay, we've got a Sensu if he tries to hit us any. That's fine. Actually, we don't even have to use anything. Ah, I have it on auto. Well... <laughs> hey, hey, whoa, whoa. Yeah, I was Link leveling earlier. We shouldn't die on this turn. Unless Krillin doesn't card, then we can definitely die on this turn. And if I must int Krillin doesn't dodge, and then we will die on this turn. Krillin didn't guard, we can die. Yeah, yeah. What if we just instantly die? Dodge. It's a good thing he didn't super, huh? This rotation should be fine. So, thankfully, they do have Turtle School together, him and Yamcha. That would be, uh, what? 20% attack and defense? Where is it? There it is. Two key, 20% attack and defense. Pretty good link. I mean, it's a very good link. I mean, not downplay it, it's a very good link. I'm gonna save those five orbs for Roshi. We'll go over his kit now. So Roshi, he gets 30% defense on super. Uh, no other effect he has there. 120% attack and defense when performing a super. Plus 30%. Uh, a medium chance of guarding when he gets three or more key spheres. And then he gets an additional attack and defense plus 50% with five key spheres. And then STR types get a two key 30% defense. And that is. Okay, and then he just he just gives that to STR types. And then when he gets uh, three STR key spheres, they get an extra 10%. Which also, all of that also applies to Roshi himself, which is pretty good. But we couldn't get it in there. So let's check out what Roshi's stats are on this turn. He was at 100k start of turn, so he's basically gonna get 150, that's uh, the 120 plus the 30% from his super attack effect. So his defense is gonna be sitting around 250k, not the greatest. We can get that up with like support and stuff, some better links. Yeah, I'm just getting, getting a lot of limelight here, you know? What if you just super Z- okay. <laughs> I didn't even get to finish saying, well, you know, what if he just super Yamcha and he doesn't dodge? Um, well, if we're, if we're below 50%, we can revive with uh, Roshi next turn. Physical Roshi. Okay, so he double supered. He's at, uh, what, 180k defense on this turn, then? 280k, and he got the guard. So this Roshi can be pretty good, as you can see. Did he seal? Oh, okay, I'll just say. So what we're going to do here is we'll try to get some same type of orbs for the Dokkan attack later on, maybe. Okay, we'll leave those in orbs around. Hopefully Yamcha can clear those out. 
Now you want to guard Quillen. All right, but it's wonderful what you've given me. Uh. Okay, now this Quillen's not taking damage. That's not good. Can we die, please? Stop it. Super. <laughs> Roshi's gotta get super and he can't. Okay, I gotta use a, I gotta use an item anyways. Ooh, we can get the five orbs and the three SDR with the support. So he goes from 70k to 120. Okay, okay, okay. Hold on. And he's got everything active except for over and a flash. So should I just go over all of his links at that? Yeah. So World Tournament Champion, which is 10% attack, uh, no, just 10% defense in 2 key. That's a pretty good link. Yeah, there's some units he can get that active with. Turtle School, you know, we already went over that. Two key, 20% defense. Was it? Don't. Oh, yeah, it's 20% attack and defense. Come in now. 10% when performing a super. Supreme Warrior is two key and 10% attack. Over and a flash. Three key and 70% attack. Yeah, I. I mean, on the Turtle School team, Kaioken Goku? Uh, I mean, the Kamehameha team, I don't know if this guy's gonna be a staple over there. And then Infighter is 15% uh, attack. All enemies minus 15% defense. And then we got Shattering the Limit, 2 key, 5% attack and defense. So what we're looking for on this turn is Roshi's attack stat. Because LR Jackie Chun, he I mean not LR Jackie Chun. Max power Jackie Chun, he gives attack support. No defense. He gives 30% uh, defensive uh, offensive support. He certainly does make Yamcha look good, huh? Uh no. Stop. I'll be a real sad boy if we die next turn and we don't get to see SDR Roshi with support. I mean, I'll just have to hop back in, but I'll have to hop back in. <laughs> Alright, Krillin, don't sell. <laughs> yeah, no way. W Krillin, W Krillin, <laughs> Willin. Okay, you, you didn't have to flex on me like that. Do your thing, Krillin. Hey, hey, whoa, whoa. Perfect, we can see Roshi taking some attacks as well. Okay, there we go. There's the defensive support kicking in from LR Roshi. It's getting everything except for a world tournament champion. He lost 10% defense. But Roshi's giving like, what, 30%? He's giving 40, okay. Yeah, 130k defense. Okay. Uh, we are cooked. Uh, physical Roshi's gonna get us killed, but I do want to see SDR Roshi doing his thing, you know?
5.7 is the attack stat. Okay. Easy guard. Come on, super, super, super. I gotta see it. I gotta see this one. It's with his guard active. Okay. I'll take it. Because the thing is, if like if that's a harder hitting boss, yeah, we died. But if that's a harder hitting boss, I'm pretty sure Roshi would still survive. Even though we did see him take 500k from Cell Max, huh? I'll bring this point to like a super battle road stage. We'll see him just, just a little bit longer, you know. Get some more time with our boy Roshi. So here's the thing, uh, coming in on Super Battle Road is actually, actually up there in difficulty. It's not really, not really anything too crazy. If you have like a unit that guards for a couple of turns, you can probably smoke this stage, but uh, with items as well. But okay, we've got Roshi in a pretty decent turn right here. I don't. If we if we don't get Roshi's STR orbs, I'll reset and just give him the tech orbs for his five orbs. However, what I will do is I'll I'll get Yamato an attack off so he can hopefully get some higher chances to dodge. I don't want him to get crushed. Okay, 89k defense out of turn. Let's see, is this drop in a favorable manner? That's only four orbs, but it will give him the support. We haven't got that in the video just yet, the extra 10% he gets. Yeah, obviously it's not as much as the 50% he gets when he gets five orbs, but... Uh, for the sake of the showcase, let's go. Oh... Uh, hate to break it to you, but we're immediately dead on this turn. Uh, Yeah, that's cool, but Roshi, yeah, physical Roshi can't survive back there. That's all right. I, I think we'll, I think we've seen enough for Roshi. We, we can see, you know, he can do his thing, or he can get crushed. Wow, never mind. This stage is. I mean, Yamcha does have crit chance, but jeez. Can you not get folded in two seconds? Okay, four point eight. He can do his, you know, double supposed double defensive buff. Oh, and then Roshi's got this stuff. Oh no, the SDR enemy is still here. Roshi would have to. Oh no, he's. Oh, it auto targeted him because everyone else was dead. <laughs> you know, this Goku does share some links with Yamcha. Just not all in the family. Might as well pop it. He's gone. We can see with all the family active next turn. I mean, over in a flash next turn. Come on. Crazy how my camera's focusing on my mic. Please stop that. You don't need to focus on my microphone. There's a whole bunch of cells here. I mean, I'm just getting. They get turned into toasted popsicles. Toasted popsicles? What is wrong? I meant to say pop tarts. I don't know what's wrong with me. Kao Ken Goku creates orbs. I forgot he creates STI orbs. Still only had 100k defense, but they share Shattering the Limit. Yeah, we can see Kamehameha over in a flash and Shattering the Limit. That's decent. Okay, now we, we know Yamcha can't... He can't just kill every Cell Jr. on this rotation. We, we have to see what Roshi can do on this turn. Okay, Yamcha, you know, Yamcha's being Yamcha, he's just sitting in slot one in all of my showcases. 
Whoever died because of Yamcha in a showcase, probably. I just don't remember. <laughs> I mean, we could take this. Yamcha's dodge. I mean, he did enough attacks. 4.9. That's without support and stuff. Because we saw with support, he was hitting 5 million easily. That's because he's got the uh, on super multiplicative buff, which uh, pairs better with like startup turn support. Okay. He's on old. We got version Z Goku and his support coming on the rotation next turn. Oh my goodness. Were we really fighting these guys again? I forgot just how many times these guys were spammed in Super Battle. Probably should use that active skill. Uh oh. No, the AJ Orbs are gonna block that. Hmm. I mean, we can see what Roshi can do with only three orbs. DK defense. Uh, uh, yeah, I think we're gone. <laughs> if I'm being quite honest. Yeah, I mean, if you have to triple super, triple crits, and we know we never get to see how Roshi performs with three orbs. Okay, no, he's not gonna do. What if he gets tagged? Okay. What if he gets tagged? This is type disadvantage, by the way. Okay. <laughs> and go to the seal. I mean, stun. Wait, Roshi... No, he's not gonna kill Gohan. Alright, let's get some tanking in Roshi. Yeah, I said let's get some tanking in Roshi. Okay, he's taking damage. He's not taking damage. That's type advantage that we didn't take damage from. So you really just want his guard to activate, and then... Because even when his guard activates, he can still take damage. So I guess, I mean, that's the thing. At least he can be mid, right? He has the ability to be mid as a free-to-play unit. I'll take that. Like, from summonable units, that's unacceptable. But as a free-to-play unit, I'll take, you know, the ability to be mid. I actually do want to see this Goku put on the show here. Namek Goku. Take his two hits. Get a super attack off. And then I'm going to see what Yamcha does afterwards. This Goku actually doesn't have Turtle School. That's unfortunate. As a Link, anyways. He's got the category. Which is so strange, because, like, Jackie Chun, he's not, on, he's not on Turtle School. Like, all the Jackie Chun characters, but, like, Goku, when he puts on... When he puts on the Whiskey, he's on Turtle School, right? And I'm pretty sure even when uh, we get into like the Time Patrol Goku, he's probably going to be on Turtle School, even though he takes off the Turtle School Gi. <laughs> or the symbol anyways, he almost... Does he ever take off this Gi? Like to fight? I don't know. He's always rocking the orange and blue. Okay. Sit KO screen. Well, it's STR Roshi. He's he's an option, you know. Uh, he's a real unit if you want to put him on the team. Many guards, he can win unit. Well, you can win an event with him on a team. Uh, just one thing before I wrap up the showcase. I do want to show you my build and his categories. Yeah, that was my last clear. That should just yeah show up here. 
So this Roshi, he gets a... Uh, well, no, we already went over his kit. He's got 19 additional, 10 dodge. Got the little defensive equip down there. He's on full power. Yeah, all these categories need help. I mean, except for Kamehameha. Uh, you know, full power. Dragon Ball Saga. That's that's a W for Dragon Ball Saga. Uh, I got... I, I have to have to have to grind both of them. And this dude, hey, he gets such a massive buff with the Yamcha. Kamehameha really is not hurting for options. Uh, Bottom Master and Disciple. Uh, as, as a team with like so many like ways you can go with it, I do appreciate a Roshi here. As you can see, you can go the Beerus and Whis route, you can go the Trunks route, you can go like the Goten, I mean, the Gohan route. That's probably gonna be like a bunch of Gokus and Gohans. Tien is on Bottom Master and Disciple, you know? Oob. So you got an Earthlings base, you got a Sand base, you got the Gods base. Even Piccolo is in here as well. Yeah. Earthlings, I mean, this is just his bread and butter right here. He links well with just about any Earthling that's also on Turtle School. Even Tien, he shares some good, decent links with. Battle of Wits, that was actually a mission for the uh, Cell Max Red Zone stage. I'm not sure, I don't remember if I used him in there. Like, to beat the event. I brought him into the stage, but... I'm not sure if that completed run was uh, with him or not. And then Earth Bread Fighters, which is just Earthlings 2.0 plus a bunch of other units. All, every Earthling in the game is on Earth Bread Fighter. But uh, that's about where the showcase ends. I'll catch you guys in the next video.